I think I got involved in organizing and being an activist. Uh, must have rubbed off on my mother, who was a pecan shell worker. Emma Tenayuca, the great activist of the times, uh, got her to participate with all the pickets. They worked to get better wages and better living, uh, working conditions. She would always brag about those kind of things. She was very proud of that. Well, he's well known in the uh, communities. In fact, he's known as Westside Henry. That's his, uh, his label. Whenever Henry uh, makes a, an appointment, for example, for city council, uh, elected officials, they open the door and say, Henry, come on in. What do you want us to discuss? And they open the door to, to LULAC because of Henry. He's one of the strong leaders in this community. I like to see myself as a good soldier. Anybody that has a good issue, whether it be immigration, housing, um, civil rights, I'm there. The immigration issue, you know, big supporter, was always there uh, behind us. Cesar Chavez, getting our, our street named after Cesar Chavez, you know, uh, we just continued attacking. Uh, Henry would call press conferences after press conferences. And Henry Rodriguez, when you think about activism in San Antonio, at the state level, at the national level, Henry has been there. Well, you can always count on Henry. You can always count if, if you have an issue, if, if, if you have a, a, a problem um, at a school that needs to be solved, uh, unless you bring Henry Rodriguez with you, they're not gonna even listen to you. You really needed a Henry Rodriguez to go uh, beat down the door to, to, to be heard. My resolution, which I was the only one that was allowed to get up and explain it and get grilled on it, passed unanimously. Whether he's at City Hall, championing a cause, at a school board, or a commissioner's court, Henry has a saying, prove him wrong and he'll walk away. That embodies that si se puede spirit. It comes from the heart. Uh, he's been with LULAC forever. If there's some injustices going on in, in school, we're gonna go investigate it. If there's uh, some discrimination going on in, in somebody's job, we're gonna go look at it. As they say, God broke the mold when he made Henry. And uh, he's been true to the cause. He has never uh, wavered from his responsibilities as a leader. He will keep doing what he does until he leaves this earth. Fue a recibir el título del Hombre Tejano del Año y fue hecho por la organización LULAC el fin de semana pasado. He's been a great gift to this community. You know, he's, he's had the opportunity to, to use his strengths to move us forward. His main objective is to get things done for the community.